Welcome back to my channel. So I kind of have a haul for you guys today. It's more of a back to school or back to uni slash fall haul. <laughs> that all rhymed, did it, it? Also for a lot of these pieces, they're not modest, like just by themselves. So I'm pretty much just gonna show you how I take them and I make them a little bit more modest. So yeah, this video is just like a bunch of things, you guys. <laughs> All these clothes are from Talover Clothing. I will link them in the description box below if you guys like anything that I show you. And yeah, let's just get into the video. <laughs> okay, so the first thing that I have is this button-up dress. Actually, these style of dresses have been like super in, like the button-up type. And then it's just like a little bit flowy when you go down to the bottom. And yeah, the thing that I like to do with these kind of dresses that are a little bit more revealing is actually layer another dress underneath it. And I feel like it looks super cute. I personally think it looks so much nicer when you layer something underneath it. Like it gives it a little bit more of a fall vibe to it instead of just wearing it by itself. And because it's brown, hello you guys, fall vibes. The dress that I was wearing underneath this one is actually more of a spring type of summer dress. But pairing it together with this cream type of color definitely gives it a little bit more of fall vibes. And just to add a little bit more of a pop, I added a belt around my waist. And yeah, I kind of just like how it turned out. If you guys like it, let me know in the comments down below. Also, like I said, I will link this dress in the description box below. Okay, so the next thing that I have is this button-up type of sweater dress. And... <laughs> I didn't realize I had a thing for buttons, but apparently I do. The thing that I really like about this is just like how there's like these adjustable straps on the top. Pretty much how I decided to style this is just with some brown pants and a white button up shirt underneath the dress. And I just thought it looked really cool. And then I thought, you know, for all my hijabis out there, if you guys want to know what hijab you should probably wear with it, I think it would look really, really nice with a black hijab. And yeah, it's just a very simple, super uni type of looking outfit, if I do say so myself. <laughs> so the next thing that I want to show you guys is I got a bunch of crop tops. And when you guys are thinking about, you know, crop tops, you don't really think of like modest dressing. But personally, I feel like they're really great for if you have like a shirt that doesn't really have sleeves on it, it's perfect for that. And it's even better for that because if you have something that's like long sleeves and you layer this on top of it, it's kind of get it kind of gets like a little bit bulky. Do you know what I mean? We don't like the bulk. We do not like the bulk. Okay, so the first crop top that I got is this orange one and I thought it was so flippin' pretty because this one has like really, really cute like little stars on it. This is actually like my favorite type of orange color. There's so many different types of colors within colors, you know what I mean? <laughs> Anyways, I thought it was super cute because it has like tiny little stars on it. I don't know if you guys can see from here. So the way that I decided to style this is actually just with a dress underneath. So this is actually just like a strappy type of dress. So it doesn't have any sleeves and that's good because we want to avoid the bulk like I was saying. But yeah, this kind of outfit is just super easy to put together. Like if you have a dress that you really like and it's not modest from like the sleeves, it's just super easy to pop on one of these. It doesn't just add like, you know, different colors and like a different style to the dress but it's gonna give you way more coverage. So I also decided to pick up this red one. Actually, it's like in between red and pink. So it has cute little flowers on it and it's like super frilly, not as fall as like the others, other like pieces that I picked up, but I thought it was really, really pretty. And then I got this polka dot one, you guys. I got so many polka dot things in this haul. Like it's, it's not normal. I'm wearing polka dots right now, but anyways, okay. So yeah, this one is just white and simple. I thought this would just match like a lot of things, so that's why I picked it up as well. Okay, so the next thing that I got is this jumpsuit that I'm wearing. Um, it's polka dot, it's super cute, like the fit is so nice, and it has like this little belt right here. Yeah, this jumpsuit is super comfortable, green for the fall. I always try to pay attention to the undershirts that I put under like for example a jumpsuit like this because you want an undershirt that's not just like super basic because it can definitely like add or take away 
from the outfit that you're already wearing. So it's important to find good undershirts. But yeah, for this outfit, it's just super simple, easy to put together. Also, I absolutely love how this outfit looks with a cream colored hijab. I just feel like it looks so much better <laughs> with the hijab than without the hijab. Kind of just adds another really nice fall color. So yeah, for all my hijabis out there, if you guys want to know what it looks like, this is how it looks like. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Also, you guys, I'm not kidding when I said I got like so many things that are polka dot. <laughs> oh I don't know why. Sometimes I get something in my head and like I get so, so many of like the same thing but whatever i love it i don't care so another jumpsuit that i got is this black one it has white polka dots on it and the thing that i like about it is it has like this little tie in the back and yeah i pretty much wear it with the same undershirt super easy to wear okay you guys i really hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope it inspires you if you're going back to uni or if you're just trying to put together you know, a fall outfit and make it like a little bit more modest. There are so many ways to make a piece that isn't modest a little bit more covered up. So I really hope you guys got some inspo from this and you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys very soon. Bye.